This is 10 Eyewitness News, first at five, with Georgina Lewis. Good evening. Pauline Hanson's controversial chief of staff is being investigated for flying the senator around the state, allegedly without a proper pilot's licence. But the One Nation leader is defending James Ashby, insisting the probe is a political witch hunt. Christina Castales reports. Pauline Hanson's political adviser may have spread his wings and earned his stripes. All right, just your name and title, thank you. James Ashby and um, just pilot for Pauline. But his high-flying career may have landed himself in trouble with the Civil Aviation Safety Authority. It's understood Mr Ashby was flying his boss around on a recreational pilot's licence in a recreational plane, which means it can't be flown for commercial purposes. The aircraft was plastered with One Nation logos as the pair flew around Queensland in 2015 and also during the 2016 election campaign. And from Rocky, we're going over to Great Keppel Island, Great Keppel. heading over there, Great yeah. Keppel. The One Nation leader is defending her chief of staff. But it's a political witch hunt and I'm not going to stand back. She claims the investigation has been instigated by her questioning Cass's CEO's lack of industry experience last year, writing to the Transport Minister, I am aware that Mr Carmody is not a pilot, aircraft owner or has any direct aviation business background. The plane has been investigated before by the Electoral Commission after the party failed to properly declare its use in the campaign and whether it was donated. Who paid for it? That's not my business, not my plane. Who bought your car? If Mr Ashby is found guilty, he could face fines and lose his pilot's licence. But according to his boss, his job isn't in jeopardy. If he's found guilty of these accusations, are you sacking him? <laughs> <laughs> Please do. No. Give me a break. You're not going anywhere. Christina Castellas, 10 Eyewitness News.